Hello, um, I'm Ollie King, I'm the music therapist for St Nicholas Hospice um, and during this time I thought it'd be a really great idea to produce some videos um, for some singing groups and we've been doing a lot of work in the singing group down in Fetford um, and it'd be really good to uh, widen it out really to people all over um, the catchment area really for St Nicholas Hospice. So what I thought we'd do is we'd do a singing session. We're going to start with a little bit of a warm up for the body. It's really important to warm up the body, warm up the voice, um, and then we might sing uh, three or four songs. And then at the end of the video, um, I'll talk a little bit about where, uh, how you could develop singing further. Um, singing is a really important thing to do. It's great for the mind. It's great for the body. It's great for the soul. It's great for everything really. Um, physiologically it's a great workout, um, it's almost like a form of exercise. Uh, it's uh, feel good chemicals in the brain which it gets going as well, it's great for the breathing as well so there's an awful lot of stuff, a lot of big advantages and evidence um, is that you know singing is actually really good for our health. So that's what I thought we would do um, today. This will be a regularly updated video and may not always be about singing but um, I hope to regularly update this. Okay. So if we're starting to think about how we're going to sit, um, it's okay to sit down, that's absolutely fine. Um, when you are singing, it's okay also to dip in and dip out. Don't feel as though you need to do every single exercise and every single bit of every single exercise uh, that we do this afternoon. Um, if you're not feeling terribly well, just watch it first time round and then maybe just do a couple of the exercises and maybe a few verses of, of a couple of the songs that we might do. But it's entirely your call and if it feels like it's too much, just have a bit of a relax, don't worry too much about it. So we're going to start by just being physically aware of our bodies, um, making sure that both your feet are firmly on the ground and really feel as though you're connected to the earth uh, through that. Okay, really being aware of your body. Um, so it could be that um, we start with just picking one foot up, sorry you can't see my feet, I'm sat at a, a keyboard, um, but pick one foot up and just rotate your ankle and then in, if you pick your other foot up and rotate that ankle just to get them really kind of flexible, that's it. And then if you've got space, move to the knee, be conscious of each knee in turn, so take the right knee first of all maybe go back and forth, rotate it a little bit, and then your left knee, that's it. And then moving further upwards, um, go to the arms, okay, and hands, and just give the hands a bit of a, a bit of a ring, that's it, move fingers, kind of warm them up, that's it, okay. And then move the ankles, ankles, Let me try that again, move the wrists, and then arms and then up to the shoulders that's it and bring shoulders up this is a great tension one great one for reducing tension so you bring up shoulders as high as you can and hold and hold and then release okay that's a really good one and i think we should do that one twice actually it's a really especially for me actually i tend to suffer from shoulders so we come up again high as you can and hold it and hold it and then release. Okay, that's a really good one. And then we go, it's worth just massaging, massaging your cheeks, that's it. Check there's no tension in your forehead. Really important, we, get, we carry so much tension around in our faces, um, so it's really important to be very vigilant of jaw and forehead as well. That's it. Um, so now we are going to tilt our head forward. Just very slowly, very slowly. That's it and then back to normal position then we might tilt it back a bit look up that's it brilliant and then we might go sideways to the left very slightly be careful that's it okay and then we might go to the other side to the right okay that's good and then breathe in and out and in and out. That's it. One more and out. 
Okay, so now we're, the body's kind of warmed up, and we're going to think about warming up uh, the lungs and the voice. And this is a good way to do it, is to sing some notes. So we are going to start by singing just long notes, um, and just literally start with... Okay, so just long notes to do with that. Okay. And here's a bit of an introduction. We're going to go just humming very quietly. gentle kind of warm-up there. So another exercise that we're going to go on to is to sing long notes um, starting on a mm, on a hum and then opening out to an open vowel on um, R. So mm, ah, mm. I'll demonstrate a few, join in when you feel ready okay. So long notes and we're just going to start with a hum. exercise that one need a lot of breath for that so it's easy just to kind of maybe just dip in do some of those again don't overextend on all of these kind of things and the last kind of warm-up I thought we would try today um, and we'll build on these as we go through the weeks um, is peas and cabbages all right and it literally just goes and it goes Peas and cabbages. Okay, we just give that one a go. Go for a few of those in the same way that we did with the last exercise. Okay, here we go. And peas and cabbages. Peas and cabbages. Peas and cabbages. Peas and cabbages Going up a bit Peas and 
That's all we need to do on the warm ups for today. Take it nice and easy. So now I think it's time to sing some songs. And I thought we would start with some songs which uh, are really well known. Um, song choice, uh, everyone has a different opinion of what is their favourite song. Um, and it's really difficult actually when it comes to terms of kind of choosing the right kind of songs for this kind of thing. So I went with some really traditional songs, which is where we may stay. That doesn't mean that you're, I think that this is what you necessarily will like, but it's a great way to just uh, get into singing. Um, so I thought we'd have a go at singing the uh, What Should We Do with a Drunken Sailor. I will put some subtitles, hopefully, um, at the bottom there. They should appear in a minute. Um, it's quite a long song, so we might have a couple of piano sort of interludes as we go along and uh, sing along with me and we'll give it a go. All right. Okay, and it goes like this. What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? Sober, put him in the brick until he's sober. Put him in the brick until he's sober. Early in the morning. Hooray and up she rises. Hooray and up she rises. Hooray and up she rises early in the morning. What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? Scuppers with the deck goes on him, put him in the scuppers with the deck goes on him, put him in the scuppers with the deck goes on him. song which I think would be a great one to play um, and sing um, is uh, She'll Be Coming Round the Mountain. It's a song which most people know although it has considerably more verses than I ever thought so it's a big learning curve. Um, so anyway dip in or sing the entire thing it's absolutely fine whatever okay. <laughs> She comes, she'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain, coming round the mountain, coming round the mountain when she comes. Singing, I, I, yippee, yippee, I. Singing, I, I, yippee, yippee, I. Singing, I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, yippee, I. She'll be driving six white horses when she comes she'll be driving six white horses when she comes she'll be driving six white horses driving six white horses 
horses, dragging six white horses when she comes. Singing I I yippee yippee yay. Singing I I yippee yippee yay. Singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee yippee yay. Oh, we'll all go out and meet her when she comes. Oh, we'll all go out and meet her when she comes. Oh, we'll all go out and meet her. To meet her, or go out and meet her when she comes. Singing, I, I, yippee, yippee, I. Singing, I, I, yippee, yippee, I. Singing, I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, when she comes. She'll be wearing pink pajamas when she comes. She'll be wearing pink pajamas when she comes. She'll be wearing pink. She will have to sleep with Grandma when she comes. She will have to sleep with Grandma when she comes. She will have to sleep with Grandma. Have to sleep with Grandma. Have to sleep with Grandma when she comes. Singing I I yippee yippee yay. Singing I I yippee yippee yay. Singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee when she This last song for today is a bit higher, so you may need to sing this kind of down, or you can sing it up where it is. Um, but it's a good song, and it's uh, it's a long way to Tipperary, and I think we'll sing through it twice. All right, okay. See you at the other end. It's a long. It's a long way to Tipperary, it's a long way to go, it's a long So I think three songs for today is a good start. Um, we've done three really well-known songs. Um, we've done What Should We Do With a Drunken Sailor. Um, she'll be coming around the mountain and it's a long way to Tipperary. And this is only really just an introduction. It's scratching the surface of what you could actually do at home. Feel free to log into YouTube. There's so many really good videos of the great Elvis, um, whoever. Um, takes your fancy, um, Cilla Black, uh, it could be the Bee Gees, songs by the Beatles, Rolling Stones, um, Dolly Parton, Jolene, there's another really good song. All of these songs are actually on YouTube, um, many of them have got the lyrics running alongside the bottom of the video, so it's a great way to get into singing, okay, and I hope to see you all very soon, thank you.